Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I am Brian, thanks for tuning in. Today I'm doing another wandering straight pour with my split cup. Um, I'm using some really nice colors. I'm only using four. Um, I'm hoping to get a really, really cool pattern. I'm gonna use my spinner to rotate the canvas again. That seems to come out really, really well. Um, so the only challenge to these kind of pours is you gotta keep that hand pretty steady as you rotate the canvas. Uh, so sometimes after you're holding that thing up there for so long, you kind of get the shakes. So at the end of the pour, it tends to get a little wobbly. So uh, that's why I tend to, um, as I get to the end of the pour, I kind of come towards the edge of the canvas. That way, that'll be the first thing that gets tilted off. So, all right, guys, let's get out on the canvas. Let's talk about these colors and we'll get started. I'll be right back. All right, so what I got today is a 20 by 20 gallery wrap canvas. Got a taped and push pinned on the back. Today we're gonna to be using our split cup again. We're gonna need about 15 ounces of paint. So I've got a 16 ounce split cup. So I'm gonna fill it up pretty much all the way to the top. The colors I'm using, I'm using four different colors. I'm using Amsterdam in the Thalo Blue, Iridescent Gold from Pebio. Peacock Pearl from Deco Art in the Dazzling Metallics, and Titanium White from Amsterdam. Uh, my pouring medium today is Liquitex Gloss Medium, Floatrol, and a little bit of water. I've got a pretty, um, uh, it's like a medium thick, um, it's a little thinner than I would for my ring pours. I like my ring pours pretty thick, so this is making a mound and kind of making a small mound on itself and sinking really quick. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna layer um, the gold and white on the outside and the um, phthalo blue and the peacock pearl on the inside. And then we're going to pour this out in a uh, wandering straight pour. And I think I'm gonna use my uh, spinner to kind of rotate the canvas as I'm pouring out. All right, so let's pour gold on this outside chamber. Phthalo blue here in the second chamber. These middle chambers are a lot deeper than the outside chambers, so I'm trying to scrape everything I have. This is the Peacock Pearl. And the white. Got a good cup here. We're gonna get a good pour out of this. All right, we're gonna start pouring. Thank you. 
All right, we've got some really crazy looking design here happening. So I've got some of this blue that I painted around the edges to make sure my edges got covered. So I'm gonna use that as some flow extender around this. All right, we're gonna start tilting this out. So of all the places that I poured, the ending is what I don't like the most. So that's where I'm gonna to start to open this up and bring it down. Thank you. 
really nice. I love this phthalo blue with the peacock pearl. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm loving the lines. Um, trying to close this peacock pearl up just a little bit more. clean up my edges and torch and then I will bring you guys in to see this up close I'm really getting some great effects out of this this is really really nice all right here we go so what I'm seeing here is some feet from like a bear. I'll show you what I'm talking about. I'm loving the composition though. This peacock pearl and phthalo blue together, just gorgeous. See that? Kind of looks like a barefoot or some sort of animals with feet. The gold and the white together really play well each with each other. Just gorgeous. All right, we'll see this when it's dry. I'll be right back. All right, check this out. This is really beautiful. I'm loving the gold and all the streaks and lines that come with it. It's just beautiful. I'm seeing, uh, like I said earlier, I see like a lion's foot down there in the bottom left. Um, yeah, just really, really cool. Let me bring you in here. All right, that's gonna do it for today's video. Check it out, it really dried great. The gold is really playing off of the white. Really beautiful, loving the lines. Loving my little bear claw feet. So cool. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video. Thanks everyone for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, that'll let you know when I do post new video content. Everyone have a great day. Bye-bye.